Hey everybody, Heather from Hooked on Pickin' here. We're gonna wait for a few people to come on live, but we know that Thursdays at 11, I do a live stream. Just a reminder, next week I'll be traveling to the VIA warehouse. And so our live stream is actually going to change to Wednesday and it'll be um, 10 o'clock Pacific time, noon uh, Central Standard Time and 1 p.m. on um, Eastern Standard Time, sorry. Um, go ahead and give me a shout out if you're jumped on live. Um, we've already got some people on saying hi. Midwest Mama's Adventure says she's smoking so fast she's smoking. Laugh out loud. <laughs> your, uh, there. Oh, awesome. Lisa says laugh out loud. Uh, Sen, uh, CNN says laugh out loud. I love this channel. Awesome. Great. So if I accidentally drop due to internet, go ahead and just wait a couple seconds. I'll be right back on live. Um, you'll know when I sign off, I'll let you know. So um, I wanted to let you know that I'm going to do a fire sale. I went bonkers on discounting prices on my own website simply because I've still got a lot of uh, pallets to go through. If you want to scan over kind of my mess I've got working right now. And so I'm trying to make room for a lot of the product that I would prefer to sell. And so some of the stuff that I've had for a while or I have have large quantities of I just went bonkers discounting stuff so I'll show you each and everything in just a minute but I want to give you a rundown about what's going on um, in the future so next week I'm taking a trip out to LA um, we're gonna go and tour the VIA um, or via trading uh, warehouse and so on Wednesday April 10th my live stream will not be on Thursday it will be on Wednesday the 10th 10 o'clock Pacific Standard Time, noon Central Standard Time, and 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And then Thursday, because you guys wanted to do this, I chatted with the guys out there that are, uh, I'm visiting their warehouse, and they're actually going to let us meet at their warehouse so you can kind of see a functioning liquidation warehouse. Um, on Thursday, April 11th, there'll be a meet and greet with me and my hubby um, from 3 p.m. to 6 p.m. So you can come anytime in that time frame. We'll go ahead and meet. You kind of get to see their warehouse, but the biggest is Q&A with me and getting to know each other. So hopefully that works out great. Um, so just put that on your calendar Thursday, April 11th um, at the v, uh, Via Trading Warehouse, which is based in Los Angeles. So um um, I'm super excited to meet a lot of you viewers and um, we'll just go ahead and get right on um, to the fire sale. If you have any questions about any of this info, go ahead and shoot it during this live stream. So, um, so the fire sale uh, that I'm doing today, all the products I'm going to show you are already listed on hookedonpickin.com. That's hooked on picking without a G. And so www.hookedonpickin.com is all you have to do. The link is down in the description. Um, I would say if you see something you like, buy it right away because a lot of people, the last time I did a fire sale, the pet beds were gone just like that. And a lot of them wanted the pet beds. So I have not gotten any pet beds recently, but if I do, I'll let you know. We have a question. Always right says hello from Chicago. Hey, I'm new to your channel. Awesome. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, CNN says good morning from Half Moon Bay, California. Awesome. Uh, Heather and Paul love your content so much nicer with two mics now. Yes, <laughs> yes. We're not two mic'd up this time, but we'll yeah. later. Uh, let's see. DLC says hey guys, love your channel. Uh, Carol Wilson says so. How much is a pallet? Um, well, pallets vary in price. Um, I spent on the 11 pallets in two cases that I uh, bought, I spent around $5,000, but you can buy pallets as low as about 150 and then you pay the, to have it shipped to you and as high as three grand. So that gives you an idea. All right, so let's get to the things that I have severely discounted because I've got tons of things. This is a um, pop teenies kind of kids game where you get to make your own popsicles and they got little figurines with it. This is also another set um, that I don't have as many of these. I think I've only got three of these. So check that out on hookedonpicking.com. Um, some of you bought all of my stuffed animals and um, I actually found um, I did another fire sale previously and I had boxed up some stuff for customers and then they chose not to. I've got uh, one of these guys and then two of the gray dogs um, of the stuff and they're still discounted at a really really steep discount so if you want those go ahead and check those out I've got these New York Yankee wiffle ball plastic bats. It says New York Yankees on them, has the symbol. Um, these are brand new, and I've got four of these at a super cheap price. They're just taking up space, and um, so that's why I'm discounting them. Yes. Kara Wilson is saying thank you. Uh, good to know. Thank you from Ohio. You awesome. You your question. 
Uh, Bethany P. says, still bitter about the pet beds. <laughs> Just kidding. Uh, Dom G. says, hooray for the truck drivers. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> you bet. Uh, Allie B. says, uh, we are selling pet beds locally, and they get sold almost overnight. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Joyce Baker says, hi, Heather and hubby. Awesome, awesome. All right, we're going to keep moving. I've got a bunch of these, and if you looked at my website before, they were priced a little higher, and I want to get these gone. I've had them forever. I want them gone. Um, as you can see behind me, I have a stack of them, and so go ahead. I discounted them ridiculously cheap simply because I have so many of them, and I'm just making a room for stuff that I need. I've got some of these fun. These are actually crossbody patriotic um, conceal and carry purses. You put the weapon here um, and then you can carry those or just use the pocket for whatever you want. But I've got a couple of different kinds of those. I have another conceal carry over here. This one's cool. It kind of flaps up and opens so it's much bigger than it actually looks. And then it's got two pockets for conceal carry on the back. The, um, I have di various different colors of this style, but this is a crossbody bag as well. And then I've got this DeWalt. And the reason why this is listed on my website and not sent into Amazon is I'm restricted in selling DeWalt. So you guys get the benefits of being able to buy it at dirt cheap prices. So it's actually brand new, never been opened, still completely concealed in well, the box. Well, I actually opened it. Oh, yeah. Second. To make... It's still yeah. wrapped up brand new. Looks yeah. great. So he opened it to make sure all contents yeah. were uh, present. And then we just taped it back together. So it's actually an impact driver combo kit. So check that out on my website. I've got it dirt cheap. Um, I've also got two. You guys really loved these and buy his wounds bracelets. Um, those are the only two I have left of those bracelets. So if you like those, go ahead and purchase those. So if you like something, go ahead and purchase it while we're on live. Yeah. Okay. Uh, DLC says, awesome visit to Bulk. Looking forward to VIA trading. Be careful in LA. Yes, thanks. Uh, Susan Estes says, hello from Pennsylvania. Awesome. Hi. Uh, CNN uh, donated $10. Awesome. Thank you for the donation. So, I really appreciate that. You say a coffee for each of you. Thanks for everything you do. Awesome. Uh, Linda Myers says, good morning. Good morning. Uh, Joyce Baker says, when are you going to unbox again? Um, I have uh, two other pallets already scheduled to uh, come out on my channel. Um, I think tomorrow I've got an unboxing because I've been really kind of hammering through the pallets and going through a lot of the stuff. Some of these things, too, that you're going to see in my fire sale have not even been revealed in unboxing pallet videos on my channel yet. And so you're going to get first look because you, you're on live. Uh, DLC is saying, w will you be selling the metal detectors? Uh, yes, I've actually got them listed on my website right now. Um, you can buy them for $50 a piece. So um, there's no picture listed with the metal detectors right now, but I do have them listed on hookedonpicking.com. So if you want them, they're 50 bucks a piece. They've been tested and they do work. Uh, ha Hassan Pauler says, hello from the Philippines. Love your unboxing videos. Awesome. Thanks. All right. So with uh, we're just going to keep going on the fire sale so you see what all you can get. I've also got these bullet bracelets, which are really fun. I've got bullet flashlights and other various things, but there's various different colors of the bullet bracelets. So check those out. Um, and then, of course, if you, any of you saw my Hatchimals, I've discounted these ridiculous because I want them, I need the space. And so um, if they don't sell here, I'm going to just throw them in a garage sale and delist them off my site. So if you want those at a really discounted price, check them out. Um, I've also got some of these. These are actually completely sealed and brand new. They're 23andMe DNA tests. I've got a couple of these and they're really discounted. Usually these are around 60 bucks and um, I've got them for $29.99, I believe, on my site just because I want them gone. Um, uh, a lot of you may have seen me unbox this guy. I've discounted him severely, but he's brand new. The Vault Boy from, um, was it Fallout? Yes. Uh, William Heath says, hey, from North Carolina. Hey, William. Uh, Catherine Durr uh, donated $10. Awesome. Thank you, Catherine. Says, thank you for information. Hello from Montana. Awesome. Is it cold up there? Yeah. <laughs> We're starting to slowly get warm here. Yeah. Joyce Baker says, how much are your bullet bracelets? Um, bullet bracelets. Are they for men too? Like yes. Back in on the yes. They can be for men or women and they're adjustable. So I'll show you. They can they just pull out and they're adjustable like this so they can fit any. Um, and then the there I think I've got them priced 
$6.99, $4.99. I don't remember right off the top of my head, but I've got them steeply discounted um, and it'll go first class mail. So you won't pay hardly anything in shipping for those. So, and the, of course, the more you buy the, you know, the cheaper the shipping rate. So, um, but I've got a lot of different, see, I've got a bunch. So there's black ones too. There's dark brown and there's, um, I believe there's brass looking ones and silver looking ones are the two metal types on those. Um, here's something I just unboxed in one of my palettes that my, my daughter really wanted to keep. <laughs> I wouldn't let her. Um, I've got three of these neon glowing cactuses. And so those are really fun. You just use a regular USB port charging cable to charge them, but they can sit anywhere and they don't have to be plugged in, which are, which is really awesome. I figured this was a good time of the year to kind of do, um, floaties. And so I've got two, uh, different styles of little floaties. Uh, those I actually bought on clearance, I think from Walmart, uh, a while back. And so I've kept them until this time of the year and then finally listed them at a really discounted price. Yes. Uh, CNN says, I just bought your DeWalt, DeWalt combo. Great price. Thanks. Awesome. Awesome. The DeWalt is gone. That, that Sorry. Is a, that's a good deal. Yeah. The DeWalt is gone. So see, you got to buy it if you want it right now. Um, and then of course you see down here, I've got a bunch of toys. Um, I know this is the wrong time of the year, but I do have a few of these. Um, so if you live up in the North, go ahead and buy one of those snow strikers. And then this is a really neat set. This is a, um, roller chalk set um it's got a little paint tray and all that and so we opened it to make sure all the contents were there but that's really neat and then i've got two of those huge black and decker kids toy tool sets so those would be a perfect buy for um a young child that you know loves to just do imaginary tool working stuff um i've got this hex bug nitro circus um if you look up on my website, Hexbug, or look under the toy section, I've got three of these. The only reason I didn't send these into Amazon is there's a little ding in the box. Um, and, but I've got three of them that kind of just have that damage, but um, the item is still fine and the actual factory seals are still good on all three of the boxes. And so I've got three of those. Those are really awesome. If any of you guys are looking to, you, you want a close up on something, just let us know. Yeah, so if you want us to zoom in or, or explain something a little more, let and me know. Or, uh, Mike asks, can either of you sing a short hymn? Uh, every Sunday we do, and you can watch that live, actually. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. How do they get to the line? Uh, if you go to any of my motivational moments uh, videos, it will it has the West Cape Baptist Church live stream. So, so anyway, I could do a little short. Amazing Grace. That's all you get. All right. So I also have this um, Milestone Baby Blanket. It's really, really cute. It's for photographs. So you circle, you put something around whatever month they are in age, but it's, it's so soft. And so I've got a bunch of these. These are brand new in package. They'll stay poly bagged and they'll come exactly like you see here. And so uh, there's that. And then we have um, an Arizona Cardinals duffel bag. So it's a good size duffel bag and it zips totally closed like this, has some meshing, but this is brand new. Um, there just wasn't a listing for it on Amazon. So that's why I put it on my website. Then we've got this. These I think are really fun. So yeah. if you've got toddlers Those are neat. Um, and they are trying to learn their left and right foot, they're little stickers that you stick inside and each little pack comes with two sets. So there's um, a dog and a house one and a bee and a flower one. So if you have a girl or a boy, you can use, and each, each pack that you buy will have five of them. Cause obviously, you know, you have more than, more than a few pairs of shoes, um, but they're all the same left and right. So they can learn the bumblebee is this foot and the flower is this foot, or you can say the house is this foot and the dog is this foot. So they can learn to which shoe to put on properly. Yes. Uh, Melinda says first hello from Mon uh, Montana Alto uh, West Virginia or Mount Alto sorry Mount Alto West Virginia awesome love your videos uh, do you ever get candles and bath bombs with jewelry in them um, I have sold a few bath bombs I don't think I get the ones with jewels in them but I have sold a few bath bombs I don't usually just because Amazon restricts anything with like perfumes and chemicals from sending into the warehouse so that's not something occasionally I will get stuff like that in a bulk box um, and um, I'll either use it myself or sell it at a garage sale I generally don't ship those things because they're easily broken 
So, all right. And then I've got this brand new, never been opened Shopkins. I'm just restricted in Shopkins on the Amazon platform. So that's why it's on my hooked on picking at a very discounted price. All of these things I can sell on my hookedonpicking.com website cheaper than I can on Amazon simply because the fees are much lower. So there's that Shopkins happy place. It comes with the pets too, I think. Um, then of course I've got some bling hats uh, that I have discounted. Um, I've got this one and this one and I believe I just have a few of this style left. Um, this was available in a fire sale um, and so, yeah, these are really, really nice. If you d are not into bling, <laughs> but you want a big puff on your head, here's some pom-pom <laughs> hats. So I've got these two. These are really fun. Those are awesome. They're very comfortable. And it has a detachable palm. So if you wanted to put something else on there, it just has a regular snap on it. And so that's kind of fun. These are really cool craft things. I've got a bunch of these and I've had them forever. And so they're really, really steeply discounted. They're also very light. So shipping's going to be super cheap on them. Um, and so I've got a bunch of those. Those are great. And then... Heather, can I yeah. step in here? Sure. Let's see. Uh, Dom G says, Santa's early April workshop for sure. Yes, yes. So Christmas in April, because I need room to keep unboxing and basically listing things that I feel like are, are higher value than some of these. Some of these are really good value, but I just have so many of them. Uh, Melinda says, thanks for answering your question. Awesome. Uh, Susan Estes says, how much for the bling hats? Um, I believe I have them listed for um, 10 bucks a piece. $9.99, 10 bucks a piece for these. So yeah, they're really, really cute and comfortable. And they have adjustable, this one has an adjustable leather strap, I believe all of these do. Yep, they're all the same, adjustable leather straps. Um, and then I, if you're if you're not in the bling, some of you guys out there, um, I've got these really cool military hats. Cool. Yeah, they're, this one is super soft, um, way softer than a traditional uh, trucker hat, and it's got a removable patch that says USA underneath. So a lot of people put unit patches from where they've served before on there with the Velcro, um, and then it's got a neat flag there, and it says USA. I thought it said oh these ones say USA, but they're all brand new. So I've got quite a few of those. And then, of course, I've got a black one with embroidered flag. You want to show the back? Yeah. This is just an adjustable plastic. Just All, the trucker. Yep. But it does say style. USA on it. And then I've got, um, so there's the black one. Then I've got a like a khaki and green one. Um, same style, says USA on the back. And then I've got a gray one. So if you guys are into, and they're all $10 a piece. And so those are really um, a good deal. You can't usually find those for that price. Also, just a reminder, I do the mystery boxes for boys and girls. And then I just had a customer actually request a specific age group in the mystery boxes. Always email me at hookedonpicking.com if you're like, well, I have a one-year-old. I don't want a bunch of toys that they're going to choke on. So let me know. I can try to personalize as much as I can. Um, and I'll let you know if I don't have anything in that age range. But I've got two huge totes of things that I pull for my uh, mystery boxes behind me. And I always am getting new product in. And um, a lot of the stuff that I ordered for my wholesalers, I also put in here. So I've got a lot of brand new product, not just liquidation, um, that I also put. Most everything that you get in, um, in the mystery boxes are brand new. Yes. Uh, Cheryl Brown uh, uh, comments back to Bethany and says, I'm mad about the dog beds as well, so I bought a case from Bulk that had one in it. Laugh out loud. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> um, I've also got these guys. This is a VTEC Shoot, Score, and Learn. Um, I've got two of these, and as you can see, the only reason that I didn't send these into Amazon is just the box is smushed a little, but the, everything inside is unbroken, works great, is brand new. Um, it's just a little damage on the box. So I've got two of these. Uh, those are also for sale on my website as well, and so those are a good buy. Um, I Yes. Cheryl Brown is saying, hit that thumbs up, Pete. So oh, yeah. Please do. Smash that will. like button if you love this video. That's so I'm going to keep on going. Okay, so I kind of went through the toys at the beginning. Now I've got some fun things for you adults. This is a crock pot. I have opened the box. I just got this out of a pallet yesterday. And so nobody has seen this even available yet on my channel. Um, I looked at it, it's brand new. There's absolutely nothing wrong with it. I think it was just a customer returned, but everything works great and it's brand new. So check that out. I've got it for sale on that. I've got um, this little, it's basically like a diaper genie or a diaper uh, trash can, brand new. I've opened it up just to look at it. It's brand new and so I resealed it. 
it still in the plastic never been used obviously you don't want to use one of these um i've also got um nope not, i thought i had another diaper genie but i don't uh heather cheryl brown is asking can we buy live uh yeah buy? uh yes the everything that i'm showing you is already listed on hookedonpicking.com so we'll show you the website if you just go straight to hookedonpicking.com you can go ahead and buy it there right now and all of the prices are already discounted i also give free shipping on anything any um order that dollars in product and so if you order a bunch you'll get free shipping so um just to make you aware of that so just go straight to hookedonpicking.com and you'll be able to buy every single one of these items because i checked and lowered all the prices of everything i'm showing you plus i've already got discounted prices on other stuff so go ahead and peruse the website yes uh lana or lana or lana so sorry uh -huh. if i mispronounced the name says hi here from chesapeake virginia again awesome awesome um, I think I got starting about this mini, but she's for sale on there. I've had her for a little while, and then I put her in a shelf and realized she wasn't listed anywhere, and so I put her back on my website, and so she is available um, at a really steep discount. Here is a lot of people, when I did my fire sale last time, I didn't have it set up this way where you could buy right away. Here's a Moen. The only reason I didn't send this in, it's a really nice, neat brushed nickel faucet. All, everything is there. They even have the little drain thing for the bottom of the sink, but the box had a hole in it, but all of the contents are undamaged and brand new. So if you need, wanted a new um, faucet. Got a question from yes. Mike. He yes. says, hey, Heather, how are you feeling about your office and warehouse space? I love it. I'm able to process so many more things um, and just work more efficiently. Um, when I worked out of my house, um, I can I just basically, right. you know, g was stumbling all over it. Here, we'll kind of give you a view. Right. Mike, you can't do this in your own home. Yes. At least in our home, you couldn't. Yeah, I would turn into a hoarder. Um, if you look, uh, I'm actually in the process of working on an Amazon order that's going to go out. Uh, if you show them the table of dolls that I'm going to make tons of cash on. So you'll have to watch my unboxing video to see what kind of dolls those are. But I'm making uh, right around $800 on just that all those dolls on that table there. So yes, so basically I love it. Uh, I would never have been able to get this many pallets in my house or anywhere else. So I love it, it's great. Um, I got in my last pallet tons of these airbed mattresses. Most of them, I checked, I opened the boxes and most of them look like they're still sealed. Um, but I severely discounted them because I'm not going to take the time to kind of test each and every one of them. I want you to know that if you buy something from me and it's completely unworking, all you have to do is contact me and, and I'll give you a refund on it. So just make sure... Um, I usually just ask that you give me a, a video or a picture or something to prove that it doesn't work. But I have queen size airbeds and twin size airbeds and more queen size airbeds and they're Coleman and they're deep ones and, and narrow ones and all various different sizes. Um, I've got some here and then I've got stacks of them over there. So check those out. Yes. Uh, Joseph is asking a question. Joseph Mullins, I'm not quite sure what you're asking. Uh, you might have had a little typo there. Okay. Uh, something about pastors at a church. So. Uh, I, I'm a pastor at Westgate Baptist Church in Trenton, Illinois, and uh, Heather is my right-hand woman. <laughs> yes. If you want to say it that way. Uh, Dom G., do you have a local mall where you could rent a kiosk to sell your wares and advertise your business? That's actually a good idea. I'll have to look into that. I thought about doing the flea market from time to time, but finding time while I'm busy shipping all the stuff out is usually the hardest thing for me. Ivan says, hello from the island of Enchant, Puerto Rico. Nice. Love your videos. That sounds amazing. Yes, Beautiful. yes. Hopefully it's not super damaged from the hurricane that hit yeah. recently. So. Uh, Lana says, Qu uh, question, what is the good rank on Amazon I should look for? What are the good numbers that you would look for? Um, it really depends on the category, but I would say anything under 500,000 um, is going to sell okay. Uh, if you're under um, 100,000, it's going to sell pretty regularly for you. So the lower the number, the better. So that would be kind of my ballpark. Of course, you can get in the $10,000 range. You're going to definitely move your product. 
Uh, let's see. Aileen says, I wish you and I lived over there. You got so many good things that I would like. It's a bummer that I'm in Australia. Yeah, it is a bummer. So I did address that question when we were at bulk. Um, can they ship overseas? You can get it shipped to a, a USA hub and then you have to arrange transportation for your product from there to your country. So I do know it's possible. I don't know how much work that even entails, though. Uh, Lana uh, just says thank you so much for answering her question. Awesome. Hey guys, any question you have, just yep. feel free to Go ahead and out. shoot that out. Uh, yep. Paula Potts says, first time catching you on live. Hello from Ohio. Awesome. Hello. Yeah, we're kind of neighboring states. All right. And then I've got this cool Lasco ceramic pedestal heater. I looked online. Um, it's The box has been open and kind of in not good a shape. Um, but I looked online. These are running for around $100. And so I've got it really, really cheap on my website um, just because um, I can't send it in with the box in this condition. But but the, uh, the actual item is in really great shape. I've also got behind me, I didn't pull these down, but behind me I've got this popcorn machine and it is basically brand new on the inside. All the contents are there, um, but I can't sell this brand. Um, I can't sell this brand on Amazon. So it's on my website. I've also got a Graco. Um, this is a pack and play and it is brand new unused. Um, and so let's see if I can find a picture of what it looks like. There it is. Yeah. Um, and I think it's like a greenish color. You can look on my website. I think I do have an actual colored picture of it. Yes. Claudia says, hello from San Diego, California. Awesome. Uh, Susan says, my husband is here. Please show the bullet bracelet and the green hat. Well, the green hat okay. is right down. Well, I've got two green hats. This one is the one with the patch. Um, and you take it off. It says USA. Super soft. Um, and then it's got a Velcro adjuster on the back. Hopefully I didn't do that too fast. And then I've got a green and khaki one that's just trucker style with adjustable and it says USA there. So there's those two. And then the bullet bracelets are over here. Um, and I've got various different colors. You can get um, in all three colors of bracelet um, leather, you can get the the silver or the brass looking color. So, and the variants are on my website, and so you can choose exactly what kind you want. Um, and so those are those those things. Uh, for those of you who are online in California, stay tuned. I'm going to be actually. I'm going to kind of go back to this. Um, let me show you the last few things I got for sale up here. Um, this Honeywell uh, humidifier, I've got two of these. They are brand new. I just can't um, sell them uh, this brand um, and send them into the warehouse. So uh, they're we, on my website. We pick up that Lasco heater again. Yes. Got a comment about that. Uh, Catherine says those Lasco heaters were great and last long. Yeah, it also has a remote with it as well. Yeah. Um, and so it's a ceramic pedestal heater. Right. Very so. Good. Yep. Don't forget, if you want toys and stuff, you can buy my mystery boxes online. Um, oh, I didn't talk about this. These is a, This is a really cool set. Um, they're African necklaces. They're continent. Af I got these really, really cheap from a wholesaler. And so I've got them really inexpensive. I don't know. Is there too much glare on them? It's good. It's good. So that they're kind of brass looking and silver, and then they, they come with a matching bracelet. So you can get the brass or the silver, and you can choose which color you want of those. Those are really neat kind of leather ones. Um, but I wanted to come back over and kind of talk to you guys about this. Obviously, we're doing the fire sale today, but um, VIA Trading, I'm going to next week. It's another liquidation warehouse based in LA. Uh, we're going to do a live stream not on Thursday next week. It's going to be on Wednesday, uh, Pacific Standard Time at 10 a.m. Uh, Central Standard Time, it'll be at noon and 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time Wednesday next week instead of Thursday. Because on Thursday, we're actually going to, for all my California viewers, put this on your calendar, um, look up the, the Via Trading Warehouse. We're going to do a meet and greet with me and my hubby because we'll be there and he's going to open it to you guys to come and meet me. They got a conference room and stuff where we will be able to actually do a face-to-face Q&A from 3 p.m. to 6 p.m. at the Via Trading Warehouse there in LA. So if you can find the time to sneak on over there, please shoot me a message. Let me know that you're coming. I would love to be able to, you know, recognize your name when you, and then put a face to the name. But um, if you, uh, if you want to just pop in on over there from three to six, I don't know if we'll have two people or if we'll have 20 people. So, um, 
or 200 people. <laughs> that would be awesome. But anyway, um, so check me out there, uh, 3 p.m. to 6 p.m. via trading um, next week, April 11th. That'll be a meet and greet. And then watch out for that live feed. So um, uh, basically, if you want discounted stuff, check out my uh, fire sale that I got going on on my website. Um, I've got lots of stuff already. The DeWalt uh, tool thing is gone because someone bought it already. Yes. Uh, Tracy Sykes says, do you have any computer uh, printers? Um, I do not have any computer printers. Uh, the last printer I got, I actually shipped into the Amazon warehouse because it was in brand new condition and sold it for like 180 bucks. Uh, Romaine says, uh, hello from Colorado. Hope you do well with awesome. the fire sale. So, so far, guys, we're up to three sales that have come in. So, thank you so awesome. much. Awesome. Yeah, thank you so much. Uh, Heather, we have quite a few that have joined since you started. Okay. So, you want to go through a few of those? Yeah. So, basically, we're doing a fire sale. And if you don't know, I'm taking a trip out to California. We're going to do a meet and greet. So, if you haven't seen that info, go ahead and you can back it up later or I'll re uh, go back to that. So this DeWalt is already sold. Sorry. Someone bought it already. But I've got these kind of games, these pop teeny games. I've got um, for, for little girls. All of these things are discounted simply because I need to make more space. And so they're severely discounted. If you want to show the hookedonpickin.com website that they can go to to buy it, just go to hookedonpickin.com. Everything is already listed and it'll calculate your shipping automatically once you put in your address. So that'll um, be available for you. So this is a conceal and carry purse. I've got a couple of these available. You put the weapon in the back. Um, it's a crossbody bag. I've got some smaller ones as well and some larger ones. Um, this one I just slashed the price of because I've got a bunch of these and need to get rid of them. But they do make noise. Um, and work uh, and they you know open up and all of that kind of stuff so that you put it all together and it's a big long apparatus for Star Wars and you can buy more than one and put them both together all those lightsabers Heather. oh apparatus I know <laughs> sorry my brain was turned off for a minute Heather, a couple questions yeah uh, 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 Adeline says or Adeline says hello from Michigan hey Cold, rainy day here hope you have a good sale today awesome uh, Aline Robinson says how long uh, are you doing the fire sale for um, I, it'll probably be primarily for today. I'd like to just sell out of these things. So probably today, maybe partway into tomorrow. And then uh, Joe says, uh, hello, sorry, I am late. Yes. Glad to join you. All right. So I've got some of these guys. I sold most all of my stuffed animals and found a few more um, in, in stuff that people had previously asked to buy but then never paid. And so um, I've got one of these guys and then two of the big gray stuffed dogs. Uh, and I think I've got those listed for four bucks. So those are really cheap and they're huge. Uh, of course, you guys saw the bullet bracelets in there for men and women and adjustable. You got the remote cars. Also. Yes. I don't think I talked about these. I've got a bunch of these um, brand new. There's nothing wrong with them. Um, I just have them on my website because there was no listing on the Amazon.com website and they weren't moving on eBay. And so I thought I'd offer them to you guys at a cheaper price than what I had them listed on eBay for. But there's black ones and blue ones. I think I've got four of one color and two of another. So you can get those. I've got, yes. Hold on one second there. Uh, Betty LM says, hello from Massachusetts. Hello. Um... Lisa R says, where do you find a fire sale? How do I purchase? Uh, yep, just go to hookedonpickin.com. Right hookedonpickin.com. Yep. I think I'm focused on it there. Yep. You can go right there and then you can. All of these things are for sale right now. So. Uh, Lisa is from Minnesota, she says. Awesome. Melinda says, how did you get started doing this or something like this? What made you want to start doing it? Um, well, I have a whole long video uh, um, on my patron page for those of you who are my patrons. Um, and you can jump in as little as $5. But um, the, the short version is basically my husband is, is a pastor and they're not known for making a lot of money. And so therefore, um, I just started reselling random things around the house. And then um, it kind of grew from there. We started going to auctions, realizing we could buy things on the cheap at auctions and then flip them on eBay for um, profit. And then I got, it just grew from there. I started going to retail stores and then liquidation and then, you know, it exploded. <laughs> uh, NG2101C says, hi from the UK. Hello, we're doing a fire sale. Uh, Jenny F says, hi from Pennsylvania. Awesome. She says, I was wondering if you are able to check out the rank of something on Amazon without a selling account. Also, do you know in advance what you're restricted from? Um, 
No, you the, you get the sales rank only if you have a seller account. And um, when you do scan an item, it should tell you whether or not you're restricted. But yes, you do have to have a seller account in order to do that. And they've got seller accounts as low as 20 bucks a month, I believe. And so you don't have to sign up for like the seller pro account just to get all that info. So um, we've also got these New York Yankee plastic bat wiffle ball sets. So these are brand new. I've got a couple of these. They say New York Yankees and have the symbol. Um, and they're 30 inches long, if you were curious. A couple um, more questions. Yeah. Coupon Universe says, curious, have you bought kitchen appliances for resale? Or do you do mostly clothes, toys, etc.? Well, I do have some kitchen appliances over here. I've got a crock pot. Um, I've gotten coffee pots. I think I've got a coffee pot for sale on my website, if I'm remembering correctly. I've done um, toaster ovens, air fryers. So yes, I do kitchen appliances as well, but I always make sure they're in working condition. Okay, Melinda Rodriguez, just thanking you for answering a question. Awesome. Wow, okay, awesome. Uh, Jenny says, also, thank you for answering the question. Um, Adeline says, oh, I didn't know your husband is a pastor. My father was a pastor. Awesome. Very good. Very good. So um, if you want to show some of the toys we have down below yes. there, I've got a Black & Decker tool set down there. Um, that's really, really a good deal. Um, I've got two of those, so those are going to go fast. So head on over to hookedonpicking.com and buy those. And then I've got a cool chalk roller set where you basically has a little paint tray and you use chalk and you can do it all over the sidewalk and, and fun stuff. And then, of course, this next thing is totally the wrong time of the year to sell this, but I wanted you to know it was available and at a steep discount because I've had them forever and I need to make room for all the stuff I got in here. So um, check those out. But I do have something that is in season, these little float things I've got at a super, super discount discounted price. Um, of course, all the swim stuff is going to start coming out soon and they're going to be much higher priced than what I've got them on there. And so check out those things. Um, of course, I've got millions and millions and millions of these Hatchimal games that I've just discounted to the floor. Uh, so if you're interested in those, they do come with little, uh, includes four exclusive figurines. So even if you just want to buy them for the figurines, go for it. Uh, Heather Lisa is asking, how much do I need to spend to get free shipping? I forgot what you said earlier. Uh, $100. If you buy over $100 worth of products, you can get free shipping. Um, then I've got this cool Fallout uh, Vault Boy. He is brand new, never been opened uh, in the case. He's really cool looking, so he's for sale. Um, vault number 111 if you play Fallout. Um, I actually do have some of these DNA kits uh, for really cheap. These are usually around $50 or $60, sometimes around $100. Um, and so these are, I've got for $30. I've got two of them, I believe. And they are brand new, sealed, um, never been opened. Um, I've got three, I've got fun Minnie Mouse that I showed you. Uh, I also have this milestone blanket, which is amazing. You take a picture with your baby laying between the angel wings and underneath the halo, and then you put a circle around whatever month they are. So it's kind of a photo blanket and also just a cute little snuggly blanket you can swaddle your baby in. And so I've got that. Um, and those all come brand new. Uh, then I've got this hex bug um, kind of fun game. It's basically like a little uh, ramp that you can launch things off of. So it's perfect for a boy who wants to launch things around your house. <laughs> um, I have this... Um, these beautiful um, Africa continent bracelet and necklace sets, and you can pick a bronze or a silver. I've got this fun cactus, neon cactus. I've got a couple of these, and so they'll go pretty quick. Um, and they charge with a regular charging cable. I've got a question that's coming, Heather. Yeah. It's from KOH Merchandise. Okay. They say, hello, uh, I love your videos. Is there a way to see if you're restricted on an item on Amazon before you buy the product and scan it? Um, yes, if you have the Amazon seller app. And so if you are have an Amazon seller account, get the app on your phone. It's different from the regular Amazon app. Um, it's got a black background instead of a white one. And so load that onto your phone, attach your account to it. And then when you scan your item, it will pop up restricted right across the picture. And if you haven't checked it out, I've got a three part series in my how to section of my YouTube channel. Um, that's called the Amazon seller app series. If you can't find it, email me at hookedonpicking.com. I'll send it to you. Uh, Lisa R. has a question. She's saying, yeah. is there a spot on your website for your fire cell or is it throughout your entire site? It's throughout my entire site. And so all you have to do is just type in a few little words that go with the item and the item that you're looking for in the search bar when you shop and it'll pop right up. So it's pretty easy to maneuver. Um, and then I've got these cool crossbody bags right here. Um, they're also concealed carry and they come in various different colors. So I've got black and white and uh, I think I had a mint color uh, at one time. 
Then we got yes. a question that's come in. Susan S. says, I'm buying a bullet bracelet and a bling hat. I also wanted the leather red, white, and blue USA concealed carry purse and wallet for $59, but it shows sold out. Any chance someone canceled and I could get one? Oh. Well, I check because I know there's some orders that have come in. Yeah, so just hold those things in your cart, and as soon as we get off live, I'm going to go over there because um, it, it may have been sold out already, and I'll check that. If not, I'll adjust the, the numbers, okay, for you. So um, then, of course, I got Shopkins. I can't sell on Amazon. Only Shopkins uh, brand can sell on that, so third-party sellers are not allowed to. I've got these fun um, left and right feet things for kids. Um, basically, it teaches your kids how to uh, learn their left and right foot, and so you get five packs of these, which are um, two sets a piece, and so you actually get 10 sets in each one that you buy. Um, so I got a bunch of those, and then, of course, I've got my bling hats and my pom-pom hats, so black and red and my USA here, and then I've got this one here. And then I've got this one here for all the ladies. Um, I've got an Arizona Cardinals duffel bag that zips really small. And then I've got um, men's patriotic hats or women. Women can wear this kind too. But I've got a gray, a black, a khaki, and green. And then this one is my all-time favorite with the patch. I don't have too many of these, only about four of these left. Um, and so those come off of the Velcro, and then they're very soft. Um, yes? Uh, let's see. Ketron17 says, for the DNA kits, is there another charge to send to a lab? Yes, these are non-lab ones. Um, buy kit, choose your service, and pay lab fee online. If you want to zoom into that little green section there, it kind of describes. So that's just for the kit, and then you basically go online and um, pay the fee that you want to pay for, uh, like on Ancestry or whatever whatever. So, um, and then I've got these cool craft boxes that are really cheap. I think these are four bucks or something online that you can make a bunch of different crafts. Um, yes. I did something right. Romaine. I hope I'm saying it right to the pastor hubby. Thanks for saying my name correctly. Yay. Yay. <laughs> Woohoo. <laughs> um, everybody's name. Yes. Uh, I've got two of these for sale. These VTech um, smart shooters. Uh, it does. It has an LED string. It turns gears. All that kind of stuff. VTech is awesome for little preschoolers. Um, and it's, so it's like a soccer goal and a basketball hoop. And it tells you all fun things. So, sorts of fun things. I got two of these. The only reason I didn't send these into Amazon is if you look at the top, the box is a little bit damaged. And so I usually try to send pristine only. Uh, KOH Merchandise says, thanks for answering my question. I bought your reseller guide last week and it is great. Awesome. I appreciate how much help uh, that you give to everyone. Oh, perfect. Then, of course, I have this ceramic pedestal heater on the cheap on my website. So if you need that, I've got tons and tons and tons of different air mattresses, a lot of Coleman brand. Um, they're very heavy, but a lot of Coleman brand. I've got twin size, queen size. Um, I don't think I have any king size, but I've got various different queen size ones and twin size ones. So check those out on my website. Um, I've got this Moen faucet i'm gonna put it up here in the front here it's actually brushed nickel and it does have the little drain cover uh so that the drain cover ma matches as well but the only reason i didn't send this into amazon is because there's a little dent in the side of the box um but every all the contents are brand new a couple of questions yeah further. let's see here uh tasty buds tea <laughs> or taste buds tea he says hi from indiana i just wanted to say i love your videos very awesome. informative thank you for sharing awesome uh, Michael uh, asks, uh, did you design your website yourself or have it done by a third party? I designed it myself. Right. We went through Shopify. Yeah, I used or... Shopify, but I, I put in all of the different... It took forever. Yeah. She's amazing. <laughs> amazing. Um, this Crock-Pot is actually brand new. It's just been opened, um, but I in, investigated all the contents and it's, it's never, ever been used. Uh, brand new in good working condition. And so um, that one is on the cheap on my website. Good discount prices. Um, and then this is like a diaper genie. It's brand new, never been used. Um, still had all the plastic over the top of it and everything so uh, lisa r is asking are you going out of business is this why you're doing a fire sale no uh <laughs> if you scan over i'm doing yeah. a fire sale because i need the space because i'm in the process of unboxing all these pallets i've got four of them done some of those air beds and stuff came out of one of the um the 
things, but um, I'm too, I like some of the brands I can't sell under. And then a lot of these things I just have multiples of. And so it's taking up space on the shelves back there that you can't really see behind the pallets. But um, because of that, that's why I'm doing the fire sale. And so I want to give you guys a discount. And a lot of these things also I've just had for so long or I didn't have them listed and now I have them listed and want to make you guys aware of that. And so basically these are multiples and then obviously you see some of these things are larger in size and so I don't want to store them in here anymore. I want to get them gone and so I'm offering them really, really at a discounted rate for you guys. Don't forget about the popcorn machine. And then I've got a pack and play and then I've got two of these humidifiers. The humidifiers, I just can't sell this brand. And then I've got various different things in these drawers. Um, for sale too like here's the gray dog that i told you about and i got some more of the star wars lightsabers <laughs> i remember what they're called uh, now jennifer r is saying hey heather and paul great to be uh here live are you buying at bia trading or just visiting um i think i may buy uh the problem with buying at via is that they're in california so freight's gonna cost me a little bit and we're flying out there so um, I'm hoping to buy some things and maybe, um, you know, see if I can work a deal with shipping, <laughs> you know, uh, kind of being in liquidation, you got to work the wheel and deal. So we'll see what I can do. I'd love to be able to buy there. I am planning on doing an unboxing there of, of something that I kind of pick out and, Hey, I'd like to unbox this and show, um, you guys what it is. So whether or not I buy that one, I don't know. Um, but I definitely hope that I can buy more there. I mean, I'm in the business of reselling, so my goal is to definitely go out there and buy product for reselling. So, yeah. Um, let me give you a rundown of the VIA trip if you just got on since then. Um, and if you are interested in any of these things, go and check them out on my hookedonpicking.com website, and I will check on that crossbody bag purse and make sure it's available, because I do have two of those, I know, but they may have already gotten purchased. So, the, um, the VIA trading trip is next week. I'll be leaving on Tuesday, flying out. Wednesday will be my live feed next week, not Thursday. Wednesday will be my live feed April 10th, um, 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, noon Central Standard Time. Sorry for those of you in Mountain Time. I didn't do the calculations. And uh, 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time um, on Wednesday will be my live feed. Because Thursday, April 11th, I'm going to be doing tours of the VIA warehouse and making tons of videos just like I did with Bulk. But um, I'm going to be doing that on Wednesday and Thursday. But Thursday at 3 o'clock, we're going to do a meet and greet with me. So if you live in California, anywhere near Los Angeles or can shake loose and get to LA on Thursday from 3 to 6 p.m., we're going to do a meet and greet at the VIA Trading Warehouse. So I talked to them. I think that's going to be the easiest thing to do rather than meeting somewhere else that way because I'm already going to be there doing some videos. So at 3 o'clock from 3 to 6, I'm going to do a meet and greet. Um, and then you can kind of look around the liquidation warehouse as well. Uh, he said that that would be available for you guys. But I wanted to get some face-to-face -face time with you guys. And a lot of you have expressed interest in wanting to be able to meet and chat uh, with me and my hubby as well. So... Um, so check out my fire sale. I've got tons of stuff on discount. Um, I'll check the quantities on those uh, concealed carry bags and make sure that I have those up to date. But um, hopefully uh, you get a good deal. And we got some more questions coming in. Yes. Yeah. Um, Jennifer Arsh says uh, that, would, that would be so worth it. I live in California. Maybe we could work together. I'm a reseller also. Oh, that would yeah, be cool. Come to, uh, talk to us. Yeah, I'd that. love to see you on Thursday, April 11th, 3 to 6 o'clock. Um, so just look up uh, Via Trading um, online and Google it, and you can just go right to their warehouse at 3 o'clock. Uh, let's see. Gina says, just opened a Shopify store for a new platform. Thanks for the confidence in doing this. Yeah, awesome. Uh, 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 Gina says that she lives in California also. Awesome. Uh, I would love to meet a lot of you guys' viewers. So, And if you guys are interested in having a meet and greet anywhere near where you live, shout, uh, give me some shout outs and some um, ideas of maybe where we can do a meet and greet. Yes. Income Strategy says, I just arrived. Do you own Via Trading? No, I don't. <laughs> this, is, this is my own personal little garage warehouse. And Via Trading is allowing me to come in as a regular just reseller and film their warehouse and get behind the scenes info from my perspective. And I'm pretty much allowed to say whatever I want about it. So if it's terrible, I'll let you know it's terrible. If it's good, I'll let you know it's good. Um, but I'm excited about going out there and kind of getting a tour. I was able to do the same thing at the bulk.com warehouse. So if you haven't seen any of those videos, check those out as well. And so I'm kind of just giving you guys a behind the scenes look at liquidation in general. Very good. Hey, uh, we are going to California. 
Uh, it's our first time. Is the Santa Monica Pier worth it? Yes. I've never been to California, and we do have a day of being able to do some tourists type things. And so uh, let us know what to do in the LA area. We're thinking Santa Monica Pier, but I definitely want to put my foot in the Pacific Ocean because I've never been to the Pacific Ocean. So awesome. So give me your suggestions in the comments below. Hopefully you can find a great deal on my hookedonpicking.com website. And um, I want to get this stuff moving so that I can get into more pallets so that I have more room to be able to resell and make money. More questions. Income Strategy says, what platforms do you sell on? I sell on Amazon, eBay, Poshmark, Facebook Marketplace, uh, and then hookedonpicking.com, which is my own website. Is that it? Yeah, I think uh, it's it. Yeah. Susan Esta says, you are so cool, and your husband is a great na narrator. Oh, he's thank you. He's the, he's the voice from behind the camera. <laughs> So awesome. Well, thank you guys for jumping online. I really appreciate the donations that the couple of you have given me and also for all the purchases that I know are coming up in the future. And for those of you who have already bought and enjoy your DeWalt uh, tool that I know that somebody already bought, bought really on the cheap. So hopefully this has been helpful and you get some good deals. And remember in the end, Jesus wins.